make a way out of nowhere. Just lift up your voice and say, Carolina, the youngest of 15 children, introduced to gospel music at a very young age mm. um, by my oldest brother. He used to bring us out on the couch and teach us literally from scratch how to say. Didn't know anything about harmony, didn't know anything about songs or anything. And I remember after learning the songs, not knowing who they who songs they were, who were the artists, we didn't know anything, anybody. And I used to hear the songs on the radio and and used to think, wow, we sound just like whoever that is. So we must have been doing a pretty good job. I ended up uh, getting bit by that gospel music bug and met some of the some of my gospel heroes that would become uh, my gospel music idols, soulsters. Uh, Howie QC's, Angelic Gospel Singers, Pilgrim Jubilees, Slim and the Supreme Angels, um, Nightingales, I mean, everybody. Um, and end up producing and writing for a lot of those artists. So um, somehow or another, either I'm very fortunate, very lucky, or uh, I learned a lot from that industry. So that's how I got started in the gospel music industry. <laughs> 